Despite all bets are in. Ooh, Rupert, bad idea trusting the Celtics. Worse than when I trusted Brian to pack my parachute. <laughs> Care to place a wager? Tomorrow night on Fox's celebrity boxing, I've got Carol Channing beating Mike Tyson in three rounds. Carol Channing? You've got Carol Channing, the actress, beating Mike Tyson, the boxer. Hell, give me 50 bucks on Tyson. Yeah, you're in good company. Betting Freddy took the same wager. Wait a minute. There's nothing funny about an addiction. Vote no on Indian gaming laws. <laughs> And we're back with Fox Celebrity Boxing with Mike Tyson and Carol Channing. I tell you, Jim, how Carol Channing outlasted that barrage in the second round, we'll never know. Come here, young man. I'm going to back you one. She's getting beat. No, she's getting mad. Eh, you ain't so tough, young man. <laughs> You got you, son of a bitch. You're going down, young man. You're going down. I can't, I can't believe this. She keeps getting up. I'm so exhausted. And the winner by technical knockout, weighing in at 67 pounds, Carol, put on your Sunday clothes, Channing. Yeah. Up yours, young people. You and your rock and roll eight-track tapes. I don't believe this. I just lost a fifty-dollar bet. You know, Mike Tyson once beat up his wife, but there's nothing funny about that. <laughs> hey, it's me. Knock, knock. So, uh, you got, uh, you got my money? Huh? Oh yeah, I'll, I'll pay you soon. Yeah. Well, um, here's a suggestion. Um. Have the money by tomorrow, and there won't be any problem. Huh? Yeah, 24 hours. Why? What, what happens in 24 hours? Hey, I don't know. Not psychic, man. I'm just saying it would probably be better for everybody if you had the money tomorrow. Yeah, all right. I'll see what I can do. Sweet, sweet, great. Uh, how's everything else going? Good. All right, all right. See you later. Don't forget. Ah, uh, you're not going to forget. <laughs> Sweaty. Uh, thank you. Stewie. Uh, hey. Hey there. So, uh, it's been 24 hours. Got my money? Oh, uh, I. You know what? Just give me till next Friday. I'll have it for you. Oh. Oh, that's funny. I could have sworn I said have it today. Yeah, I don't have it. Sorry. Oh. Well, all right then. Mm, that's good, OJ. <laughs> Griffin, who is living his dream of playing for the New England Patriots. Bob? Thanks, Tom. I'm fond of your hair as well. I'm standing here with Tom Brady and his newest teammate, Peter Griffin. Hey, Ma, check it out. I'm married to a pro athlete. <laughs> what do you think of that? <laughs> We're really excited to have Peter. I think he's going to make a great addition to a great team. I want to thank uh... Diane, didn't your first husband blow his brains out? Oh, <laughs> yeah. 
coming up, America's hottest new curse word, Kleeman. We'll tell you what it means after this. Boy, Lois, I can't believe this is happening to me. I'm somebody now, you know? I, I don't have to lie to people about my life anymore. Oh, I am so happy for you, Peter. What the hell happened to you? I, uh, fell down the stairs. Well, you should be more careful. I'm not going to tell you. So, Brian, we're even now, right? Ready to start a new life in England. I've got my money. Your wounds have healed up nicely. What do you say we let bygones be bygones, hmm? You shot me in both my knees, then lit me on fire. Piss off. All right, all right. I tell you what. You get one free revenge shot at me. Okay. But I'm not going to tell you when it's coming. This is going to be fun. <laughs> really? Absolutely. For one guy to stand up to the entire New England Patriots team, that's a winner in my book. Wow. Thanks, Tom Brady. Peter, oh my God, are you all right? Yeah. Can you move your legs? Yeah. Oh, good. I thought you were going to be a vegetable, and I got to tell you, Peter, I, I just don't think I have it in me. I mean, if you can't move, it's over. Yeah, I love you too, honey. Let's go home. <laughs> 